Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I will be um, reviewing, not unboxing this time, but reviewing the uh, JC Wings 1 to 200 scale Etihad FLC 380 in the 2018 year of Zaya delivery. This has been a uh, long awaited, uh, how would you say, uh, in a long awaited model. Um, I actually pre ordered this in 2018 and it only just got released uh, in February of this year. So, yeah, two years I've had to wait for this. But nevertheless, it is here. So, uh, yeah, just going to give you a uh, bit of information about this aircraft. Um, okay, so it, uh, it the seating plan for this uh, specific aircraft has. It goes for all of Etihad's A380s. They're all the same layout. Sorry if my hands are a bit shaky. But uh, yeah, so um, starting off with the residence class, I would say that has one residence suite, uh, which allows up to two passengers in the suite, and it has its um, own private uh, seating area its own private uh, shower and its own private bedroom like I said that that can only seat two people then it has nine first-class seats up at the front with uh, 70 business class seats and then finally uh, the bulk of the seating plan uh, with 415 economy class seats so this aircraft was delivered to um, Etihad on the 13th of May 2016. That's nearly four years ago. Um, its first flight was on the 22nd of December of 2015. And, uh, and it's, if you would like to know the test registration, it was Foxtrot Whiskey Whiskey Sierra Sierra. Um, yeah, the Sierra number is uh, 199. And uh, the engines, the uh, the power plants, are uh, four uh, GE Alliance GP 7270s. Um, its current status is stored due to the uh, COVID-19 outbreak and it's been parked since March of 2020 and it's uh, parked indefinitely. Uh, the, reg the actual registration you can probably already see but it's uh, Alpha 6 Alpha Papa Hotel and um, yeah it's a very nice model. Uh, I'll just let you have a quick look. I'm going to be really, really quick with this review today. But as you can see, it does have um, a nice little Etihad uh, eagle, would you say, with the uh, flag and then uh, here it says Etihad. It is a bit dusty as I've had this model for a while and I've only just got round to reviewing it. So I'll let you have a closer look at all the detail. Has a little sacrum antenna up at the top there uh, for the Wi-Fi and the entertainment. Quickly turning the model around now. From the back, we're going to go from uh, the back end to the forward end. Again, all the doors and windows and registration up at the top there with the cargo doors and everything there. But I, I, I do have a lot more models to review, 
and I will do uh, longer reviews on them, more in-depth. As I said, if you would like a, a more in-depth review uh, of this one, I don't know how much more in-depth you can go, but please let me know and I will, uh, and I will do one. Again, for the engines, just take it off the stand real quick and I'll show you the underside. As you can see, Etihad. That's the registration under there, with all of the uh, all of the model, uh, all of the antennas and all the gubbins that it needs. Now the stand on this one is a weird one, but I like it. Um, so it's very very different. Uh, they have started doing these with the bigger models. Um, but yeah, so as you can see there, Etihad, Airbus A380. I'll let you have a quick look there. And then this here. Uh, as you can see, removed before flight. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching guys. And if you did enjoy the video, please like it. And uh, please let me know what you'd like to see next. I know I've been posting a few films lately, um, as due to uh, of me waiting for some models. I didn't know what else to put on, so I put them on. Um, please let me know if you like them. I, we, I do know that I do have a sound issue with one of the films. I will, I'm trying to get that sorted as quickly as possible. I don't really want to uh, re-upload it, but if I have to, then I will. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching guys, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.